Just Drinking's back with Rum and Cane British West Indies XO Rum. Yeah, baby. We've got a fat bottom rum oh, just yeah. for you today, Royer. Yeah, this is baby. the British West Indies XO Rum from it's Rum and Cane. British this, West Indies. This is going to be a fun experience. We've had oh, yeah. rum and cane products, we have. right? Yep. Have we reviewed any rum and cane products, or is this the first one that makes a review? I think might be the first might review. Be the first, might be might one. Be the first one. We have sipped a few of their different yes. rums there, yes, and I, this is going to be a first experience for us here. Uh, it's a very squatty looking bottle. Very, it is. very low, I'm low center of it. gravity, kind of like you. I'm going to tip that one over very easy. It's kind of well, you tip over very easily, so I guess there's a little bit of a difference I between do have you a and fat the bottom too. <laughs> <laughs> Dang. Took that and ran with it. Should have really set myself up for that one. Didn't think it through. That was, that was witty. Nice. You're welcome. If you guys are new to the show, I'm Robert. I'm Roy Air. And this is Just Drinking, where we drink rum and tell you about it. Make sure that if you love drinking rum, finding new rums, hanging out with other rum lovers, that you guys hit that Join subscribe us. button. Give us a thumbs up. Come, Come back on. each and every week, because we're know. always trying new rums. We've got the live show on Wednesday, and you can scroll down to the links down below there. we got our Just Drinking After Hours Facebook group, our Instagram, our TikTok. And if you're a real rum enthusiast, we do have a rum club where we're shipping rum straight to your door. Right and you can to sip the along door. with other rum lover lovers on Zoom, as well as distillers, and have all kinds of fun experiences you otherwise wouldn't be able to have. So make sure you check that out as well. And thanks for drinking rum with us today. All right, here we go. Hand selected, limited and edition. Hand selected. Limited edition, 100% natural, no chill filtration, colorings, additives, or sugars. This is very nice. Real as it gets. Okay, it's as really real, real as it gets. This right here. <laughs> Uh, this is a 46%, which makes this a 92 proof. Good yep, job. got there, got there. I'm on it. Uh, we got batch number two. Bottle number twelve. Oh wow! Look at that. Well, Look I didn't realize low that. Numbers. Uh, maybe we. Maybe I don't want to open this. That's one. unfortunate for you because it's too late now, Roy. Yeah, oh, we're man. this far. <sighs> and it looks like we do have a bit of a story. Oh, Robert. Please tell us a story about the British West Indies. Why I'd love to, Rum Daddy Royer. Uh, the rare regional rums celebrate impeccable provenance through a series of five award-winning rums. Each expression is unadulterated rum from two hand-selected distilleries representing the true essence of its terror. I feel like I'm saying that wrong. You are saying that wrong, yeah. but that's okay. Okay, good deal. <laughs> uh, tasting notes, we've got some citrus, stewed prunes, touch of smoke, vanilla, aged in ex-bourbon American oak barrels. Bam! Feel like American I, oak barrels. I feel like I probably didn't need to be leaning over the whole time for this. I probably I feel very old now, like I just well, got here. I probably there. could have just stood up with it like a yeah. normal human being, but <laughs> that's fine. I guess that's probably the most old guy thing I've done. I'm hanging out with you way too much. I don't know you why are. I needed to be doing I probably hunched over. <laughs> All right, Roy, I want to break right. into this bottle before I it. before I age anymore I over know, here. Right. West Indies. Oh, it's beautiful. I didn't I didn't uh, come to my head. I just uh, couldn't get there, but I like West Indies. That was good. That was really right. nice. Let's get this thing into some tasting oh, let's glasses. Let's do it. Ah, we got a nice golden color here. Yep. A little little darker golden color here. I like that look. Ooh. Ooh. A little this, vanilla. This is, this is yeah. It smells very smooth. This does smell. It has a very, very smooth, smooth yeah. scent off the top. That's yeah. that is creamy. So is this so is this a blend? Is that what this is? Yeah, so uh, I believe this is a blend of five, five award winning rums. Okay. Right? So, and this says that it's aged up to eight years, if I remember right. I don't know. I don't have my glasses. Yeah, see, I looked exactly like you just did when I was reading, and I now I'm just going to have nightmares about that. <laughs> ah, dang it. I've been watching you too long. You're welcome. Let's drink this rum. <laughs> Please make me younger. To me, this is refreshing. You know, okay. This is, okay. This is uh, this is not a dry rum by any stretch. This is not a heated rum by any stretch. What do you think? I think it's delicious. The flavors yeah. on the first note there kind of grab your attention. Nothing punches hard nope. at all. A um, lot of good flavors off the forefront. I get woodiness, oh, yeah. hint of vanilla, but hint very vanilla, light. Yeah. Tad of smoke. I don't know if I'm getting citrus quite on I, it. I, I am getting a little bit of fruit. But I think the pruniness of it there... Yeah. I can kind of pick up. I don't yep. know about the citrus, but I do get some of the pruniness to it. And I do think it kind of gives off some of those, like it kind of makes feel like raisin, a little something like in that essence. And I really like that paired with the wooden smoke because oh, it's yeah. so light. This is like that. that so, I mean, we've, so yummy. we've even, so the smoke is just, it just kind of lingers there. You know, it's not overpowering or anything. It's almost like a lightly smoked cocktail. Mm -hmm. All on its own already. You know, it's funny. It, it Like I said, it doesn't punch you, but it sits in your mouth. And then as you breathe, those flavors just enhance on the tongue a little bit. And you're just kind of, you have a nice long lingering uh, flavor going on. Oh, yeah. I love that. I mean, I Th think it's amazing. Is, this is very nice. All on its own. Yeah, I really appreciate that. I think I think for uh, sipping rum, this is tremendous. I could definitely sit down and sip this for any occasion. Uh, oh, yeah, absolutely. Not that it needs ice. This is one of the few that I'd say I don't even think I really need to add ice. I usually add an ice cube, but um, it's so good on its own. I just like this, it this like is, this. This is very good. Yeah. This is very, very good. 
spray. So we've had it on its own. We have had it on its own, Roy here. So you know what we're going to do next. I do. Do they? We're going to take this thing and we're going to do the unfathomable. We're going to take this thing and put it into a backyard rum mixer. Now we know this is not the way a lot of people are going to drink this. They're going to enjoy it on its own, put it in a more sophisticated cocktail, and they would never do this. But we're going to take a little uh, artificial sweetener of a Diet Coke, Diet Pepsi, add it in, see what it does, and see what that general backyard mixability will be for you rum and cokers out there, and kind of give an essence of what those artificial, artificial flavors will do. Will it blend? Will it separate? And we're going to find out for you right now. Here's to you, Rum Daddy Royer. Right back at you, buddy. I like this. You know, it's funny. It's, I really do. I think because I like this quite a bit. It, the flavor <laughs> grabs your mouth so much that it just takes that it sweetener, does. grabs that too, yep. adds it, it to the flavor very mix. Very well. Now, I do think you lose. You lose any side of the prune, the citrus, any of that that I think could be there gets swallowed by the sweetness. The wooden smoke it's is there. there. Little hints of American vanilla oak. is there. Um, yep. But it grabs this flavor really well, and it does blend super well. You're going to love it. It blends very, very you're gonna, nice. You're going to absolutely love it. If you're a person who has to mix it, which we know a lot of people yep. are, are going to do that, you're going to love this. You now, know? this may not be the way that you're going to mix yours. Yeah. And they, they may have better cocktails on their on their website calling out for better, better cocktails using this. I personally believe that this rum right here is meant to have on its own. I think it's really good on its own as a sipper. I do yeah. think that. But I think anybody who's going to be a good uh, backyard rum mixer, like myself, you know, I do that oh, from yeah. time to time. Yeah. Millennials. And, uh, <laughs> you know, we're going to go in here, be crazy, and I think you're going to love it. It's going to yeah. be super you, tasty. You will like this. It's definitely one. high end. You can tell this is a well put together rum. This, this is, is very this is well put very together. very delicious. And I don't know why you're allowed to drink it at this point, but <laughs> I like it a lot. <laughs> it was very good. <laughs> All right, Royer, we've had it on its own. We've had it mixed up, but how much are you paying for this bottle of rum right here? Well, you know, I mean, you kind of mentioned it there for a moment. This is a high-end rum. It is a high-end rum. You can tell, by the way. You can tell. It looks the way it by tastes. The packaging. Everything the about this rum this. screams high-end. Yeah, yeah, definitely high-end. So how much do you 90 think? bucks. I'm going straight $90. That, that's what you're going I with? think it just undercuts the $100 mark. Okay, well, you're not close. Oh, damn. <laughs> 150 <laughs> uh, Wrong way. Really? Really. It's less. It is less. I wouldn't have guessed we that. We paid $67 for this. That's a bargain. That is a true bargain. This right one there. grabs. It has everything you want yep. in a rum. It looks cool. It tastes good. All the flavors grab perfectly. The presentation on this is wonderful. It's a I, tremendous I, I experience. This really, this really stands out. It's going to stand out on, on your shelf and your bar. And uh, people are going to be like, hey, you know, I would like to try that. I also love, I want to go back to the fact that it's a 46%. And it does yes. not grab like no. a 46. Like, this is not heated. It just seems like it would be like a 40, uh, 40%. I can't imagine I would guess it would be higher than that by tasting it. No. Uh, it being 46%, there's a lot here to offer. And <laughs> a little goes a long is. ways. It does. It does. Absolutely. You know, it's moments like this that truthfully I realize this is why we spend all of our money on rum. <laughs> Again, this is not a financial channel. <laughs> this, is, this is why we spend the life savings because we wouldn't have been able to have this experience. That that is absolutely. If we hadn't true. gone through all these rums and then come to this one and been like, we should buy this one too. Yep. You know. Well, that. It's kind of all what, the dream. Kind of what happens that actually every time we go to the liquor store, it's we weird. Find something new. It's weird, but we usually become a member of wherever whatever <laughs> liquor liquor store we go to, which is pretty cool. We're yep. members of a lot of liquor stores. Yeah, we are. <laughs> They love seeing us come there. One of them, I believe, created a membership for us <laughs> while we were there, which was pretty cool too. Yeah. See, yeah. this is this is how you get places yep. high end. Yep, you just have to spend all of your money. All of your money. <laughs> all of it. <laughs> that is Rum and Cane, British West Indies XO Rum. Make sure you guys check your local liquor stores. Look them up online. Don't take our word for it. Go find yourself a bottle. Try it for yourself today, and lay, leave a comment of what you think of the rum, so we know what you think. Do it. Do it today. If you guys like what we did and you think Roy Air should just pay for everybody's rum instead of you having to go buy it, make sure that you guys hit that subscribe button. Give us a thumbs up. Come back each and every week. We've always got a fun show for you. We've got a new review and a live show every Wednesday. We'd love to have you come check in. And if you're feeling like getting a little bit more of a rum experience, you can oh, check yeah. out the links down below. We have our Patreon Rum Club with a limited amount of spaces available. But if it fits you and it looks awesome and you want some sweet rum sent to you and get to sip along with right to the some door. amazing people it and sounds just like this. Hello, I'm the rum. <laughs> That's, that's exactly what I've heard uh, from everybody in the Rum Club. <laughs> so make sure you check that out as well as the Just Drinking After Hours Facebook group, the Instagram, the Tic Tac, and all the cool bar items links down below. And thank you guys so much for hanging out with us. Royer, let's get them home safe. Always drink responsibly, never drink and drive, and no rums or harm during the making of this video. Not at all. We'll see you next time, guys. Take care. Wow.